Hunter Biden's trial began today in Delaware. They're choosing the jury. First Lady showed up to offer support. Now, Hunter Biden is being charged with gun charges. But what you have to understand, Hunter Biden didn't wield a weapon. He didn't rob a liquor store. What he's being charged for is going in, buying a gun, filling out and signing a federal form while actively addicted. Is that true? Well, we don't know. That's why they're going on trial. Now, this is a case that most people wouldn't be charged with. They wouldn't go to trial for something like this. But it's different for Hunter Biden. And why? Because he's the president's son, a Democratic president's son. And the Republicans have pushed this. They've had investigations in Congress. They pushed the special counsel to indict Hunter Biden, even though they had a deal already worked out. Now, the interesting thing about the Republicans and their point of view with this case is when they look at Donald Trump's case, where he was actually convicted 34 times for trying to interfere in an election, they say that's politically motivated. They don't say that about Hunter Biden, but when you think about it, Hunter Biden is being charged with something nobody else would be charged with because he's the president's son. That, to me, seems like the essence of politically motivated. That's who these Republicans are. They're fucking scurrilous. They're scandalous. And they're stupid motherfuckers. If Hunter gets convicted, okay, whatever. He's not the president. He should be punished. But don't whine and complain about Donald Trump because he did what he did. There's plenty of evidence. It isn't politically motivated if he really fucking did it.